During a film's production, the story goes through multiple transitions. Once it is adapted to screen, much is discarded or modified. Modifications can also occur during post-production. Disagreements can often occur between film directors, producers, and production houses. Disputes can be about a film's length, deleted scenes, reshoots, etc. A complicated film like The Matrix most definitely had many script changes and scenes that were never filmed. But thanks to the internet, drafts of the script can be found, containing much of the original story. There is one particular scene that we found interesting, a different take on Neo's visit to the Oracle. Welcome to Matrix Explained. the desert of the real. We would like to announce our new giveaway. Many of you really wanted a copy of the Matrix Comics 20th Anniversary Collection, so we will be once again giving away a free copy of this graphic novel with a poster of the original 1999 Matrix film. For your chance to win, subscribe to this channel, leave a like on this video, and leave in the comments section below which character would you like to see return in Matrix 4 and why. The winner will be announced on October 10th. In the theatrical release, Neo was not convinced about a woman who could predict his future. As he once told Morpheus, he doesn't believe in fate. In the film, Neo is obedient. He follows Morpheus' orders to see the Oracle, but the script tells a different story. Neo blows out a breath. His hand reaches but stops, hovering over the spherical handle. He backs away. Morpheus, I don't think this is a good idea. Why? I told you I don't believe in this stuff. No matter what she says, I'm not going to believe it. So what's the point? What do you believe in? What do I believe in? Are you kidding me? What do you think? The world I grew up in isn't real. My entire life was a lie. I don't believe in anything anymore. That's why we are here. Why? So I can hear some old lady tell me what? That I'm this guy that everybody's been waiting for? That I'm supposed to save the world? It sounds insane. Unbelievable. I don't care who says it. It's still going to sound insane and unbelievable. Faith is not a matter of reasonability. I do not believe things with my mind. I believe them with my heart. In my gut. And you believe I'm the one? Yes, I do. Yeah? What about the other five guys? The five before me? What about them? Morpheus tries to hide, his heart being wrenched from his chest. Did you believe in them too? I believed what the Oracle told me. No. I misunderstood what she told me. I believed that it was all about me. This is difficult for Morpheus to admit. I believed that all I had to do was point my finger and annoy whoever I choose. I was wrong, Neo. Terribly wrong. Not a day or night passes that I do not think of them. After the fifth, I lost my way. I doubted everything the Oracle said. I doubted myself. He looks up at Neo. And then I saw you, Neo and my world changed. You can call it an epiphany. You can call it whatever the hell you want. It doesn't matter. It's about this, so I can't explain it to you. All I can do is believe, Neo. Believe that one day you will feel what I felt and know what I know. You are the sixth and the last. You are the one. His eyes blaze. Until that time, all I am asking from you is for you to hold on to whatever respect you may have for me and trust me. Neo feels a rush from Morpheus' intensity, the unadulterated confidence of a zealot. All right. He reaches for the handle, which turns without him even touching it. A woman wearing white opens the door. In the script, Neo becomes a cynic after he discovers the truth. In the film, Neo had his moments of skepticism, sure, but his faith in Morpheus is established much sooner than in the script. Neo was following Morpheus unconditionally by the time he was to meet the Oracle. The Neo from the script did not believe in her, no matter what she had to say. Morpheus tries to convince Neo with faith alone, a notion that upsets him, that he should just believe in the Oracle. Neo saw the incongruities of visiting a person who apparently can predict his future within the Matrix, but Morpheus didn't. He was already blinded by the Oracle, as if he were an apostle. Morpheus' faith in the Oracle is irrational, that he believes in his heart that she is right.
We've discussed how the Oracle manipulated Morpheus using his hopes and dreams against him in a previous video. But the most interesting part about this script scene is when Neo mentions the other five. So Morpheus thought they had found the one five times before and was wrong each time, presumably leading those five to an untimely demise. Finally, Cypher's words to Trinity at the beginning of the film make sense now. We're gonna kill him, you understand that? Morpheus believes he is the one. Do you? It doesn't matter what I believe. Though in the script, Cypher's line is a little bit different. Originally, it was assumed that it would be Morpheus and his crew that would kill Neo if things didn't work out, intentionally or unintentionally. However, he may have been referring to the other five that Morpheus had encountered and led to their deaths because none of them was the one. Perhaps they died when they were awakened. The shock of the truth killed them, died during a training simulation, or after facing an agent. Morpheus trying to hide the pain in his heart proves that he still mourns his mistakes. Neo points out that Morpheus believed in them too, to which Morpheus rationalizes as a misinterpretation of the Oracle's words, but it sounds more like an excuse. Regardless, the fact that Neo originally knew about the previous five in the first movie is extremely interesting. Morpheus failed in finding the one five times. He had lost hope. He didn't believe in himself anymore. That is until he found Neo, who turned out to be the integral anomaly. I won't lie to you, Neo. Every single man or woman who has stood their ground, everyone who has fought an agent has died. They will never be as strong or as fast as you can be. What are you trying to tell me, that I can dodge bullets? I'm trying to tell you that when you're ready, you won't have to. He was convinced that Neo was it. He was the one, regardless of being the sixth choice. Just as the architect said, though with some minor modifications. That was quicker than the others. Others? How many? Others? What? Answer The Matrix is older than you know. I prefer counting from the emergence of one integral anomaly to the emergence of the next, in which case this is the sixth version. Five lines. <laughs> This proves that the Wachowskis already had a lot of the Matrix story developed from the beginning, that the sequels were not improvised, as some claimed. There are many more removed or modified scenes in the movie script, but we'll leave those for future videos. But do you agree? Was it the right call to change this scene? If you enjoy our content and are a fan of The Mandalorian and Star Wars, please subscribe to our other channel, Mandalorian Universe. There you will find daily news and theory videos about the hit show and of the Star Wars universe. For Matrix Explained, please leave a like and subscribe. And thank you for visiting the Desert of the Real.